get panicky unless they don't come out the other side like he just has. Thank you. Small boats, particularly on the good weather days, the Sunday fishing, the Saturday sailing or the Wednesday afternoon sail, will pass far too close for us. They're out having a, a good time, the weather's nice and they do not allow for the point that we cannot avoid them. Should something go wrong with them, uh, we cannot avoid them. And that causes concern because we cannot see them, we don't know what, where they are, and if something should happen with them, we don't know about it. Uh, I can't see him now at all. He's disappeared now. Uh, Chief, uh, keep an eye on that water. Tide now is uh, 0.8, so we've got 15 metres. Uh, yeah, he would be a problem. You see how slowly he's moving? 210. A big ship could take uh, to stop, depending on the speed, it might take three or four hundred metres. If we're going faster, it might take a kilometre uh, to stop. Um, to even to deviate from our course will take a few hundred metres to move from one side of the channel to the other. Uh, now he's just come out by the forward corner edge of the containers, I can just see him. For the small boats that manoeuvre, manoeuvre around Adelaide or go fishing in Adelaide, enjoy your fishing by all means, but be aware that we cannot stop, we cannot deviate from you. The small boats that anchor in the channel, they drop their anchor into the channel, but sometimes we go out with only a metre or two metres underneath our keel. We could easily pick up your anchor rope and drag you with us. Give the, the big boats what we call sea room. Give us plenty of sea room, stay out of our way, stay away from us. We don't want to hit you, we don't want to cause damage. We want everybody to travel and enjoy their day safely.